Hi there, welcome back. As we approach the highly anticipated first orbital flight of Starship, the excitement and anticipation continue to grow. The launch crew at the orbital mount is completing the final stages of the meticulous cleaning process, bringing us one step closer to the launch. Workers remove the scaffoldings on top of the OLM. With this, the area around the launch mount is clear and neat. The spectacular view before us showcases Starship in its full glory, poised for its maiden voyage into space, evoking a sense of awe and anticipation for what's to come. Elon Musk, the SpaceX chief, has hinted that the final design for the orbital launch mount has not been achieved yet. In response to a tweet, Musk stated that high-strength stainless steel armor is necessary to protect the launch stand from the powerful blast of the world's biggest blowtorch, referring to the Starship booster plume. However, Musk also acknowledged that even high-strength stainless steel could erode quickly under the extreme conditions of the booster plume. As a result, he suggested that a water-cooled steel jacket would be required to achieve full reusability. These comments from Musk demonstrate the complex challenges that SpaceX faces in developing the infrastructure necessary to support the Starship program. As the company continues to push the boundaries of spaceflight technology, it will need to innovate and iterate quickly to achieve its goals. The moment Starship takes off from the ground, the the awe-inspiring view will be unlike anything you've ever witnessed before, leaving you breathless. According to FAA's current operations plan advisory data, April 17th is the targeted launch date and I bet you don't want to miss this glorious moment. At the end of the video, I will give a link to the scheduled live stream. Hit the notify me button so that you don't miss out on the live view of the launch. Yesterday, SpaceX successfully launched its 23rd mission of the year. Intelsat 40E satellite was the customer payload for this flight. Three, two, one, ignition, engine full power, and lift off of Intelsat 40E. Go, Intelsat, go, Falcon. The first stage booster supporting the mission completed its fourth successful launch and landing. Stage one landing confirmed. There you Payload separation confirmed. 